weekend. Yeah, conditions are going to be cooling. We had, uh, well, it's interesting that the low cloud cover, the valley fog, is kind of hanging around in some spots, making for some very con hazy conditions. Even though the skies have cleared out, we have the sun coming through. It's kind of a hazy evening. 58 degrees, the current temperature in Sacramento with a southeast wind blowing at 7 miles per hour in Stockton. Yeah, the sun, it broke through. 60 degrees, a little bit warmer with some hazy sunshine and east wind blowing at 9 miles per hour. Modesto also, again, mainly the midsection of the valley and onto the west side is where we have the sun, the low cloud cover, though, still hugging the hills as well as the east side of the valley. 61 degrees in Modesto with a southeast wind blowing at 7 miles per hour. So it's a really different picture as you work your way to the east. Fairfield, 62 degrees, hazy sky, just a light breeze there in Solano County. And Lake Tahoe, up above all of the uh, fog, but we do have some cloud cover working its way in. Current temperature is 50 degrees, southwest wind blowing at 7 miles per hour. Those clouds moving in, that's a sign of some changes coming our way. Satellite view shows, though, the low cloud cover that we were dealing with today. Again, uh, some areas never saw the sun. Again, if you lived in those areas, you're saying, what sun are you talking about? Well, the west side of the valley did get some sun and actually warmed up into the 60s. Where that low cloud cover was, temperature stayed in the 50s. But what we're really watching here is this, this dry weather system that's moving into the Great Basin. You can see just this patchy network of cloud cover out there. There is some showers, a little bit of snow associated with this. This is some of that cold air which we've been talking about affecting mainly the eastern half of the U.S. Well, some of that's starting to kind of work its way in our way, and that is going to impact temperatures and also increase the chance for a little bit of snow in the Sierra and even some rain in some spots. Future cast showing that developing as we go through the night tonight. Again, low cloud cover. We could wake up to some in through San Joaquin County, Stanislaus County, less likely in Sacramento County. But look at this in the Sierra. Starting to see some of that snow as early as 7 a.m. for your Sunday morning. Most of the snow activity is going to take place south of Lake Tahoe. And with that also comes a chance for a little bit of rain. We could see some showers popping up near Stockton and Modesto. That's a possibility. Again, I don't think we're going to see much, but there's that chance. A bit better chance in through uh, Tuolumne County. County, Mariposa County. We're going to see that chance for some rain. In fact, that'll stay with us all the way through Monday. We're going to see that chance for some rain through the hills, again, mainly from uh, Calaveras County south, and then again in through the San Joaquin Valley. We could see a few showers here and there as we make our way through Monday afternoon. Sierra seven day forecast. Temperatures going to cool off. Daytime highs in the mid 30s. Haven't seen that in a while. Chance for snow is going to be there. Also, winds will be picking up on Sunday, and then we dry out for the rest of the week. Forecast temperatures tomorrow: Truckee 39 degrees, Quincy 51, Pollock Pines 51 degrees, 60 in Auburn, 58 in Jackson, 59 degrees in Angels Camp, with more cloud cover to the south, and again a better chance for showers also into the southern foothills. San Francisco 65, 63 in Antioch, with a mix of sun and clouds. We'll see a chance for a few showers again. We could see that around Modesto and Turlock. With some clouds that will be on and off again through the day. Less cloud cover around Sacramento. Woodland, 63 degrees. Seven day forecast shows those winds from the north are going to be with us on Sunday and Monday. Then taper off, and then we're looking warmer as we go through the week.